We're in Gator country. Ben Hill Griffin Stadium is the setting for this football matchup. This coin toss presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Florida is lined up to kick the ball off first, and we are ready to go. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. Ah! Caught open field. Brought down right around the 36-yard line. Check, check. Answer, Dan. He's coming, he's coming. He's coming. He's coming. He's coming. He's coming. He's coming. He's tackled around the 39-yard line. Nearly intercepted. You like it? The loudest crowds in the country, and they are on their feet. And he can't get away from the pressure. Coaches don't like it when their quarterback gets hit like that. Don't be surprised to see the old coach get on his lineman to protect the quarterback a little bit better. out to about the 38-yard line. Flag on the play. Let's see what it is. Personal foul. Clipping. Receiving team. Clipping is the call, and now they'll have to find a way to make up those yards right here. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. He gets rid of this one. there by the defense. They weren't giving up anything on that series. High is back to receive. Die builds it to 31. He makes it to the 48-yard line. Both sides to come out with some urgency. Fires that quickly incomplete. That's a tailback on the screen and they make the stop right around the 40. He has some room. He's at the 30. A nice third down. Looking for his man incomplete. He's scrambling. He gets sacked on the play. complete he's got space to work tackle around the 25 yard line wow a long game but still not enough for the first but they'll spread the field with five wide he throws it and this will be caught touchdown this guy just continues to impress me every time i watch this team play he seems to come up with big plays you knew they had to dial up something big but these kids really dug deep for an absolutely huge play and he adds the extra point a seven play 48 yard drive and they put up seven points brad how about the guys up front the offensive line giving the quarterback plenty of time to be able to read the defense and make the right throw so the score now seven nothing he'll return it from the one tackle at the 27 yard line inside give tackle after a decent run up the gut at midfield inside the 30 there he goes touchdown the halfback got the carry and weaved through that defense for a score he found some daylight and took off for six
the extra point to tie this game up. And he hits the PAT. A short two-play, 72-yard drive, and it results in a touchdown. Well, Brad, right now this offense is hot. And they also took advantage of some mistakes there by the defense. He just drills this one. And they can forget about returning this one. And so this defense coordinator has got to be living. He's got to get in their face. He's got to challenge them. He's got to get their emotions going. Because when you play defense, it's... Caught him, but they're going to lose yards. He was tackled immediately. Quickly, and he's got his man. They'll bring him down right around the 46-yard line. This one should be interesting. Once the ball's in the air, the defender's got a right. With five wideouts. Now he tries to buy some time, and he's sacked. I think that one's on the offensive line. They've got to do a better job of holding their blocks, or else his quarterback's going to be pulling turf out of his face mask all game. Turning it up a notch. He throws left. Out of bounds, around the 46-yard line. That was a well-designed and executed pattern, but on third down and forever, it just wasn't enough. Barnes to punt. Brought down at the 26. Until this defense figures out how to stop it, I think they'll have no problem moving the ball down the field. Down, down. Wait, check, check. Tries to get out of trouble, but he can't shake the defense. He's under some heat. Passing on the run, intercepted. Tackle made at the 19-yard line. He came up with a fantastic interception there. Well, you know the quarterback is kicking himself for that one. He just made the wrong read. Fires out to his receiver. And he's taken down at the four-yard line. Check, check. Two. And he's tackled around the three-yard line. He's on the run, and they got him. That makes four sacks today. Well, this speed is difficult to defend because you have to try to keep them off balance so they can't use their quickness. Hayden's in the midst of all this game. Throws incomplete. I know. Trying to take the lead by a field goal. The kick is up, and it is good. And you got to think they're pretty happy with holding them to a field goal right there. They line up to kick this one away. He'll return it from the three. He's taken down at the 29. There's a flag down, and it looks like this one's coming back. One will put the offense to forget about that last pick. He just got to stick to the game plan. And down he goes at the 23 yard line. He might have a chance. And he carries the ball for a nice game. So they the first down. He's taken down at the 29 yard line. Pushed out of bounds at about the 31. Hang on, everybody, because it looks like they came ready to play today. The Pirates with a three-point lead. Yeah, 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 yeah. Throw 
throws it to the halfback on the screen. And he's level at the 33-yard line. Townsend is the putter. And he's taken down at the 38-yard line. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. He's tackled around the 43-yard line. Kill, kill, kill! Quick throw out to the receiver, incomplete. And two, three, nine. Screen pass, he's got his half back. And they push him out around the 42-yard line. And down he goes at the 30. I think this deep... He's scrambling, and they got him. Well, we talked all week with these coaches, and even when we met with them yesterday out at practice, they told us there were some big concerns about facing these defensive ends. They thought that they might be able to hold up against him, maybe get the ball out of the pocket a little bit quicker, maybe use running backs and tight ends to help with double teams on the outside. But right now, whatever they thought they might be able to do... Ball on the 29-yard line. Complete, brought down, nothing doing. Pass out to the tight end, but it's incomplete. And he makes it out to about the 37-yard line. Quick strike to the receiver, and he's shoved out of bounds at the 46-yard line. He's hit and got away. They'll bring him down for a loss on the play. You're not going to see this very often from this running back. He just got gobbled up pretty deep in the backfield. Brown is amazing. Trying to set up a little screen. Gets it to his tailback. And they're coming after this putter. Hammond fields it at the 22. He makes it out to maybe the 36-yard line. Flag down, and I'm not sure when it was thrown. Let's find out. He did a good job there to give his team decent field position. Takes it right, he can't get back to the line. And they get the sack. The defenders played the snap count perfectly. They found the path into the backfield and didn't let the quarterback get away. Let's see if the momentum from that defensive stand carries over to their offense. Is waiting for the snap. And he's tackled at the 44-yard line. Drastically changed on just one or two plays. He's out of bounds around the 49-yard line. Knocked out of bounds at the 46. Slings it. And they make the stop at the 31-yard line. Quick throw, brought down around the 20-yard line. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. Quick strike, and he drops it. It's up, and it splits the uprights. Barnes has the ball all teed up, and he's ready to kick this one off. Sends it sailing downfield. 
This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. And this wide receiver out of the game. Uh, this offense has not been able to come up with some answers. I would continue to fight as an offensive coordinator and a play caller. Quick pass. Tackle at about the 33-yard line. run to the outside so the halfback gets some decent yards and a first down first and ten ball on the 38 zips it to the back they'll bring him down at the 42 yard line get to the back and hit hard for a loss the tackle made around the 44 yard line here's some time He gets out to about the 28-yard line. Halfback's got it on the quick throw. And he's taken down at the 39. I like easy, easy. They go with the screen here, and the halfback's got it. And he's tackled at the 45-yard line. And he's tackled in the open field. He's going to try and scramble. Green nine, green nine. Two, four. He Two, lets it go. Stays in bounds to make a nice catch. First down. It's first and ten. Ball on the 33-yard line. So the coach challenges the call, and they're going to try to determine if the receiver made the catch inbounds. So after some discussion, the... <laughs> Nearly intercepted. The punter is going to try to pin him deep in their own territory with a good punt here. He really got a hold of that one. This one will go into the end zone, and they'll bring it out to the 20. Great. He's into the open field. And he's tackled at the positive yardage. So both teams will go to the locker room looking to make some adjustments and find some second-half offense. The Pirates in front by six explore their depth see how many guys they could get maybe get a few more guys to letter by the end of the season yeah now all of a sudden they can't afford to do that the game's too close yeah i guess somebody forgot to tell the other team that hey we're just using you as a punching bag you just just come out here you know get get absolutely destroyed in the first half and, and then we're going to put our scrubs in we're going to put the guys that don't really get a lot of reps in and yeah as a coach you'd like to develop depth you'd like to have that opportunity but if the players don't come out ready to play and don't execute, you're not afforded that opportunity. Do some of those guys maybe deserve some playing time after the way those other guys have played the first half? Yeah, but your idea of bringing the scrubs in to finish the ball game, that might have gone out the window in this first 30 minutes. That's going to do it at halftime, just about ready to start the second half. All right, you finish it up, brother. I'm going to get some of the cafeteria. I'm hungry. Wait, 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 don't leave until you get my order. Brad, Kirk, take the second half. Welcome back, everybody. Second half action about to begin. From his own goal line. Tackle made at the 27-yard line. Blue 14! And down he goes around the 37-yard line. run to the left there. Looks like he flinched down there on the line. He breaks a second tackle. He's pushed out of bounds at the 42. The 31. 31. He 
keeps his eye on it, makes the catch. And he is drilled at the 19 yard line. He's tackled around the 17 yard line. Oh, and he had some steam on that throw. The five. Touchdown, Florida. This team has so many potent weapons. It's tough to try to single out just one of them to stop. They'll try to tack on the extra point that will take the lead. And he adds the extra point. So that's a seven-play, 79-yard drive. And they put up seven points. Brad, I thought the offense did a really nice job of mixing up the play calling on that drive. I thought the defense was on its heels most of the drive because of the versatility of the offense. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. It's going to be thrown by their defense. Fires it out. He's to the 40. He's at midfield. And they finally push him out at the 45. Fires quickly to the tight end. And they make the stop at the 32-yard line. Easy, easy. And he hits him hard at the 15-yard line. The pitch, and he's got some room. Nice gain as he works. And he's got the touchdown. Great call by the offensive coordinator. Big time play, taking that ball all the way in. Maybe the defense wasn't expecting a run. Never want to see a kid down on the field after a play. Not sure what happened, but hopefully it's nothing serious. Well, they're going to try for the two-point conversion. Barnes has the ball set and he looks ready to kick this one deep. He'll take it from the two. He's to the 20. He makes it to the 25-yard line. You have an idea of what you're doing and how to attack a defense. And right now, these wide receivers clearly have... He fights forward to about the 29. Open man, quick strike, and he can't pull it in. To play any more football today. Townsend to punt. He's taken down at the 32. With this strategy, or will they start to lean a little bit more on their ground game? He throws it. It falls incomplete. Pulls down the catch, and he's got room here. Brought down at about the 43-yard line. Fires out to his receiver, and he's leveled at the 39-yard line. Throws it in a hurry. Tackle at the 29. Tackle for a loss. That play was over before it got started. Quick strike to the receiver. They'll bring him down at about the 11. And he carries the ball for a nice game. Got a receiver, and he dropped it. He scrambled. They bring the quarterback down. This isn't much more than an extra point. Somebody jumped early down there. It's so tough to move the ball forward. Even a five-yard setback can do that. And that'll put him up by a couple of scores. 
Kicks up, and it sails through the uprights. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. And he got all of this one. Great kick. He's to the 20. He gets out to about the 22-yard line. And he tackles him hard at the 25-yard line. And he throws right away. Steps out of bounds around the 31-yard line. Excellent execution on one side of the ball that time. And it looks to me like the defense was in a little state of confusion. Let's see if they can pull themselves together. Here comes the pressure. That's a great tackle at the 29-yard line. Strike for the score. And he did a nice job of looking off his defenders. The draw within a field goal. He splits the uprights with the extra point. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. Sends it sailing downfield. And they can forget about returning this one. Florida is going to slow him down and take him away from the offense. On the run. And he's tackled at the 28. And he's taken down at the 24. Touchdown. Let's see if they can duplicate that on this drive. Great passing was the key for the offense the last time they had the ball. They were able to pick apart the defense and get down the field for a touchdown. One quarter to go, and this looks like it could come down to the very end. 24-21, Pirates. He's on the run, and he's going to come up with a sack. He's under some heat, going deep. The senior makes the catch. And it's a whole new ball game. Make it three passes for touchdowns. What I'm noticing more and more about this guy is he's very patient with the ball, and it's resulting in some nice scores, just like we've seen today. He makes the PAT. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. For Florida, they've been bringing the heat, and they've gotten to him on several occasions. Couldn't hang on here in the fourth quarter. Well, the focus and concentrate and hold on to the ball. Throwing right. You're playing in this stadium. Trying to set up a little screen. Gets it to his tailback. He gets hit out of bounds. Around the 26-yard line. Is the putter. And he's tackled at the 48-yard line. Taken down around the 45 yard line. My yeah. 
Throws quick to the receiver and it falls incomplete. Aim the football instead of just getting back in rhythm, stepping and throwing. And that time he aimed the ball and it was incomplete. And they get the sack. The protection broke down. The defense was in the backfield in a hurry and they brought the quarterback down. Nice play. Ten. He puts it away, and it's a great kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for. Tackle made at the 22-yard line. Gets it out quickly, and he is drilled at the 25 to play themselves. Strong showing by the defense, Kern. Hammond fields it at the 35. He makes it out to maybe the 49-yard line. Flag on the play. Let's see what it is. Clipping. Receiving team. tries to buy some time. There's a fumble. The offense scoops it. Yep, and this is why you need to know where the ball is at all times. <laughs> Quick out to his receiver. He's tackled at the 37-yard line. He heaves it deep. Incomplete. Almost picked off. So He's out to the 30. He's tackled at the 30. When he made the Open receiver drops. And a quick throw. Brought down at about the 41. He's out of bounds around the 43 yard line. At the 48. Here's the halfback on the screen. He's knocked out of bounds at about the 43. He makes it to the 42 yard line. He's going to try and scramble. Dives and he's down. Tackle around the 24 yard line. He almost had it, but it's incomplete. Caught open field. Inside the 10, and he shoved out of bounds at the 10-yard line. That minute in the fourth quarter. He makes it out to maybe the seven-yard line. Quick shot to the open receiver, and he can't hang on to the ball. They go with the screen here, and the halfback's got it. Knocked out of bounds at the seven-yard line. He's scrambling. Slides down to the ground. I think they had to go for it given the circumstances. They just couldn't pull it off. They give to the tailback. They'll bring him down around the seven yard line. 
Decent run here, right side. Gets out to around the 22. Now the rest of this clock. He takes a knee, looking to take some time off that clock. Takes a knee. The Gators know that they have to enjoy this guy while they've got him because somewhere down the line he's going to be at the next level. Well, that'll definitely be in his future, but for now he needs to sit back and just enjoy this performance and, and really the play caller, the quarterback, the offensive line, the receivers, the entire group as, as, as just a whole should feel good about their performance. Thanks for joining us for another game of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk and everyone here at EA Sports, Brad Nussler saying goodbye, and we'll see you next time.